brush, knee push, you drop the right hip. So the pelvis is pivoting around the left hip just for a moment. And then the left hip comes around the right. There you go, there. And then follow through. So the power is often never in the movement. It's in the stillness. So my left hip drops, that's relaxed. And then now I pivot around the left, but I've already done the work. If we're in a, a grappling situation, I pivot around the right hip. It's this that throws you, it's not this. That's why the, the actual throw looks like magic. So this is white crane spreads its wings. The right elbow drops toward the left knee, which is around. Now I pivot around my right hip. The left hip goes around. And it's very important when you do this that you don't try to pull his arm back. But if I reach past him and then pivot around. So I twist his hand and he resists still. So I reach for the ground, just move my left hip around and then reach down, push in here, like that, right into the thigh. Then wind up, step, hand on his forehead and we're just in a mid-range position like this. So from here, white crane spreads wings, send the arm up. Now I reach down for my foot and pivot around my right, bend my knee, step, and then brush knee, push. You grab my wrist, pin it against your hip like that. Now use your hand here to push my thumb against your hip. And then the other hand comes up here and you lift up my chin. Now from here, drop your elbow toward your knee. So it goes across like that. Extend to your hand towards your foot. If you pivot around your right hip, so the left hip goes forward. There. Like that. Keep your right hip still and the left hip goes forward. That's what powers this. From here, you drop your hand across the elbow. Like that. And reach for the ground. That's it. Now, the left hip goes forward. There! And reach, palm up. There and reach further. There. Now, all you really have to do here is just let me go. Now we're in a, a, we're in a grappling position like this. And I'm in a, we're in a tight spot and I'm about to go for a, a throw. Drop your right hand down and pivot around your right hip. There. As you drop down and I try to go for this, you pivot. There you go. And keep spinning. Turn and face me. There you go. <laughs> so from here, if you resist, here, I go down and around. That bends your elbow. If that bends your elbow, then I can get to here. Now, brush the knee. The left hand drops down. The el my elbow drops toward my side, like this. Then step, and I pivot around my right hip. I'm going to grab there, down. Here, I've got this. Right? But I can also do this. Here, if I have the elbow. So affecting the elbow rotation is not going to happen up here. Mm -hmm. It's going to happen here or down here. But if I move my left hip around, then I can affect your elbow. <laughs> there, that's safe. Always affect your opponent's center. So if you're throwing a punch at me, I can deal with a punch, but you're still going to be attacking. But if you throw a punch at me and I punch you, then that's going to take the power out of your punch. So from here, left hip, after your center. Okay. And there. Now you can put the palm up, reach out like this. There. See? <laughs> see? <laughs> see what that did? Now from any point when you're practicing free hands or freestyle, uh, you can just go to any position and then think, oh yeah, this technique. Try the movement. Right? Just, just extend down. There. Pivot around the hip. There. There. Like that. So from here, down, up. There. Small circle version of the same technique. From here, if I'm inside, I move your left hip forward, there. Left foot on its toe, there you go. Pivot around this hip again, drop your left hip down. There. So okay. what you're doing now is drop, step, drop, and then push. So from here, I get inside, drop your hip. So you step forward with your left foot, good. Now drop your left hip, leave this hip still. There, that's it. From here, if I'm trying to do the throw, you pivot around this hip. Drop back first. There. Okay, now there you go. Okay, so, I'm in. Okay, drop. That's it. Now, there you go. Boom. So, we have push me back with your left hip going forward. Push me forward with your left hip dropping down. And be a little bit less friendly. I'm in. Dro drop. Drop the left hip. There. 
<laughs> yeah. You okay? Yeah, oh, fine. Thanks. Thanks for asking. There. <laughs> That's it. So I'm in. You drop, then drop this hip. There. That's it. <laughs> and I'm. <laughs> I don't do ground fighting because the ground has much better endurance. Here, left, there you go. <laughs> See? So from here, the left hip goes forward, left hip drops down. <laughs> Boom. You bring your left foot forward. There you go. <laughs> this side, here, the right hip drops, right hip drops, right hip drops. Right hip drops. Right hip drops. Here. Boom. Brush knee push. Punch with this hand. Here. Brush knee push. Chin now. Again. Same idea. Brush knee push. If his arm is loose, then I can come in behind and do that. Boom. Considerably less friendly. Okay. I stopped there before I did it, but you see what happens. <laughs> okay, did you see what happened? Yeah, don't do it. <laughs> if you break your partner, you don't get another one. Here, palms up, step, grabs with both hands from here, palms up, strike. I can just reach for the ground, pivot around that hip, come up like this, and then lock his own elbow right into his center, and up. Boom. If he's really solid and rooted, and I do this and that's, that's going to be hard to make this technique work. He punches, not so connected anymore. Okay, and then joint lock. Movement here is half step, sit back, play guitar. He pulls, Ugh. half step. You just have to pick it up. There, and then up, play guitar. The right hip stays still, the left hip goes around. What happens usually, of course, is people do this, and then they try to move the right hip. So brush, knee, push. <coughs> Engage, like that. The left hip goes forward. There. Strike, strike, step. This hand is just going to do this. And this hand is just going to sit down like that. Well, my left hip goes around the right hip. Like that. If I fight against it, I'm going to be in trouble. If he pulls, and I go with it, left hip goes around, engage, raise the knee, Kick there, kick there, kick there if I want to. And then, sit the wrist. When I do the half step, I'm not just moving forward, I'm moving to the side. If he grabs and pulls, I extend. If he punches, half step, play guitar. It does basic ideas, you can come up with all kinds of other nice ideas. All right, so those, that's for brush, knee, push, half step, play guitar. We're going to take a break right now, and then we will do applications for twist step, deflect down, step, parry, punch. Thank you. Mm -hmm.